Hey guys, so Jason Matthew here from Trinidad and Tobago and welcome to our Biochem GM YouTube channel. Now today we're not going to be doing a specific topic in biochemistry per se. Instead, um, what we're going to be doing is looking at a recap of what we have accomplished so far, our future plans for the YouTube channel, and as well as how do we maximize the use of this service. So we uploaded the first video on January 20, 2012. Today it's May 10, 2012, and I'm happy to report that we have uploaded 23 videos so far. We have 119 subscribers with over 10,000 views, and people from over 73 countries have visited so far. So that's pretty awesome, and I know, and we thank you for that support. So these are the countries I've visited so far. And again, I just want to say thank you guys. You know, you show your love by hitting the like button. You give us feedback and we really, really appreciate it. Now, I'm going to be very busy over the next few months. My goal for September 2012 is to have at least 100 videos uploaded. And they will consist on topics that I'll be mostly teaching for the next academic year, which will be on carbohydrate, lipid, and nitrogen metabolism as well as integration of metabolism obesity and diabetes as well as well this is a biochemistry youtube channel so i know a lot of my students sometimes they would say you know their chemistry background is kind of weak so what i also plan to do over these these next few months is do some background videos on some basics in chemistry such as moles and equilibria buffers rates of reactions, uh, as well as and some energetics. So this should enhance your biochemistry kung fu, so to speak. And guys, please share this material. It's, it's free, it's available online. So share these videos with anyone you think might benefit from them. Also, you know, share your material as well with us. And if you have some real cool worksheets and, and slides and and um diagrams and so on please send it our way we'll love to have a look at it you can contact me via email by using this gmail address you can also join the my biochem gm facebook page uh, just do a search for biochem gm and please indicate that you are a biochemistry student and you want to share any biochemistry knowledge um, it's a Facebook page with all my students and I welcome you all to join it as well. Feedback. Now this is very important. All right. If we really want this YouTube channel to evolve in something that could really help biochemistry students, you all need to give us feedback. So please, you know, we won't take it personal. Any suggestions that you have to improve this service, please let us know. Also, um, I would normally design videos for my students and their needs as and for the courses that I teach but you know if you have any topics that you all want me to do please let me know I will try to do them but I can't promise because I have a really um, tight schedule but I'll try my best to get some of those videos out there for you as well so please let me know all right so the next thing we want to do is look at the YouTube channel itself so just click on any internet browser, you know, whatever you'll use. I use Safari. So I click on YouTube. All right. And then in YouTube, I will search for Biochem GM. All right. So you see these are the videos here. And this handsome devil is, well, you know who that is. We click on him. And boom, we have all the different videos. Now, now as you can see, the list is growing. And as it grows... It's going to get more complicated for you to search, but I have I have done a few things that should help you. But first of all, you all please subscribe to the channel. This is good. When you subscribe to the channel, you're going to get all the latest videos um, coming to you instantly, so you will know like what is the latest upload that I did. All right, so please hit the subscribe button so you can be kept up to date with all the different uploads that I give. Now, what you can do is you can click on videos and then you all could see all the videos that I have so far. Now, here's the thing. 
so right now there's there's only 23 videos but as i said before i plan to to at least go up to 100 videos by september that's my personal goal all right so you're going to see that going through this might be a little comp be a little more complicated than what it is right now now the next thing you can do is look at the playlist you can click on playlist now i'm designing playlists based on either topics so you could get enzymes you know carbohydrates lipids neuroscience so these are the topics so far or you can click or if you're my students you can click on the course code so like for instance if you are doing agri 10 13 you could click on agri 10 13 which is a level one biochemistry course so when you click on agri 10 13 these are all the different podcasts for this course and you could probably click on play or else you could get all the videos one after the other so that's one way in which you can do it all right so let's go back to videos now another way in which you can do it is you can use this search channel um, engine here so like for instance let's say i want to do something on enzymes and i could just type in enzymes and boom the podcast that we have on enzymes are going to come up and you can look at them or let's say lipids and there you go you have all the lipids videos all right so that is one way to look to do it as well now as you can see the different formats and the different ways in which I try to make the biochemistry topics interesting. All right, so you can click on any video. Hi guys, so and there, here again. and there you will see the video going on. All right, um, you can hit the like button if you if you like what you are seeing. You know, if you learn something, as well as you know, the, you can also hit the dislike button if you don't like what you're seeing also please you know you can give a comment here and say this is awesome or whatever all right so these are different things you can do now a next thing that some people will complain about is that it takes a while to load up well one thing you can do is that you can change the resolution of the video and you do that by going to this button here so you click on this and if you go to a higher resolution, well then you're going to it's going to take longer to load up, so you're going to need a, a pretty good bandwidth. Or you can go lower, which will require less bandwidth and it will be faster to load up. So that's that's one thing you can do. Alright. Also when Hi guys, do you smart when you are putting together like when you're looking at this video, alright look at this video this video is 30 minutes long some videos are shorter while others are longer but remember the podcast were designed in a way that you learn at your own pace and what i tell my students is that if you think 30 minutes is too much there's this button that we have designed just for you and it's called the pause button so when you think you have reached the point of saturation please press the pause button take a break come back all right and guys another important thing that you need to know when you're studying all right i encourage you all to take notes all right when you put these things in your own handwriting you learn it much better so don't just look at these podcasts and think that's it please you should have your writing material next to you and as you're listening to the podcast you write also what i will encourage is that you pause after a while and and you summarize and make sure that you got everything if you think you're missing something go back to the start again you're learning at your own pace you can pause the lecture but which in this case is me you can pause me you can rewind me you know and you can learn at your own pace so but most importantly is do not just um listen and view the podcast you need to write and take your own notes because remember in the exam you can't cut and paste you'll have to do your own writing you need to draw your own diagrams so learn from now i'm telling you it helps a great deal all right so i hope this will help you manipulate around the 
the YouTube channel a lot more. And guys, while these videos, podcasts, they are very informative, they cannot be your only resource for biochemistry. You need to go to the textbooks. You need to read the journals because as scientists, we need to be we need to be kept up to date with the material. So please, while this is this is pretty inform um, in depth, please go to the textbooks, go to the journals, do further research. All right, it, it's going to when you read um, when you get information on a topic from different sources you understand and appreciate the information much better so for your own learning experience you need to go out there and get more information and finally i want you all to remember that biochemistry is interesting it's fun and it's definitely sexy so remember those three things and guys i know Sometimes, especially at the beginning, biochemistry could seem, you know, very intimidating. It seems like it's a hopeless battle. But what I'll tell you is that everyone goes through that at the beginning. So don't give up. Just keep going through the material and it becomes easier and you're going to do fine. All right. So please give me feedback. Tell me how, how your studies are going. If the podcasts are helping, let us know how we can improve your service. All right. I look forward to hearing from you guys. So take care. I look for more podcasts coming soon. Bye, guys.